When Winifred gets Friar Tuck to tell her fortune in the cards, it inevitably involves the arrival of a young and handsome stranger. The kind of Prince Charming some girls dream about. But is this Prince all he appears to be? Or is there another side to him? Hmm. There. And folks still say that cards cannot tell the future. Friar Tuck! Hmm? Friar Tuck! Come on in. I brought you a little gift. Oh, my. Oh, don't worry. Oh, I'm sorry. I... Oh? Do you know how to read these cards? Yes, of course I do. I learned how to read the future from these cards when I was very young. Do you want me to tell your fortune? Huh? Yes, please, Friar Tuck. Thank you. Hmm? What's this? This card seems to have attached itself to you. Ah, that is a very good card to have. What does it mean? This card represents love. It could mean there's a romance in store for you. Really? Oh, Friar <laughs> Tuck, how wonderful. Thank you. But wait, you haven't told me yet who my secret admirer is. Oh. <laughs> Because I don't know, the cards don't give any names. Oh, thank you, Friar <laughs> Tuck. Thank you. Hey, wait. You still have one of my cards. Hmm? My, this is strange. This could be terrible. Together with the love card, this means... Oh! Something wrong? No, just thought I heard something. It came from over here. Probably just a rabbit or something. Maybe so. Eh, I guess you're right. Don't be afraid. I won't hurt you. Let's go. Hmm? Mm-hmm. I've never been there. Are you a traveler then? How did you get that wound? Was it one of Owen's soldiers? Owen? Owen the creep! Did one of his soldiers do that to your arm? Right, that's enough. He's ill and he shouldn't talk. What he really needs now is some sleep. What if he turns out to be one of Owen's spies? Well, shut up. Huh? Okay, Winnie. Hey, you're pretty tough. Huh? Me? I'm not. Well, thanks for your help. Uh, what's your name? Oh, I'm Winifred. Just Winifred. Winifred, that's a nice name. My name's Duncan. Pleased to meet you. Thank you for saving my life, Winifred. It was fate that brought us together. What? Winifred's doing what? Nursing a what? <laughs> 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 A man, huh? How you doing, Chief? Winifred is nursing some strange guy. So how do you think? I guess you're right. You must be feeling pretty terrible about the whole thing. Especially as he's so good looking, he makes you look like a pig. A pig? Well, looks as though you have a serious rival. So I'm a pig, am I? You better hurry up. 
Winifred might be on her own. I'll settle you later. What a dope. He gets mad at the sound of her name. Oh, I can't miss this. Oh, I see. So you followed this criminal all the way here, did you, gentlemen? Yes, we're almost certain that he came here to Nottingham. All we ask is that you tell us should you hear of anything. And one man is giving you all this trouble? He's a very dangerous man. He specializes in just stealing from the rich. Very smart and looks brave too. I can understand how he might be giving you three the runaround. Hmm. My friends, you must do as you please. I cannot help you, but I will not stand in your way. Hmm, fools and complete amateurs. Stealing from the rich. Disgusting. Huh? Hi. Huh? Good morning. Duncan? You should have stayed in bed. Hup. Huh? Hey, hup Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, wow! That was great! Hmm. Just like the circus! I used to work in one. You did? Hmm. So this was a private performance just for me. Sure! Here's your reward! Oh, Winifred. What is it? Don't you want to ask me anything? I know all I need to know. Huh? I trust you, Duncan. It's fate. But, Winifred... Remember when I first met you, you told me not to be afraid? Well, actually, when I met you, I guess I did feel kind of scared at first. But now, I only have to look at you and I feel calm. That's nice. Whoa! Whoa! Hey! Huh? Hey, guys, <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Oh. Uh, how you doing, Winnie? Hey, how long have you been here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I never want to see you again. Huh? Max, will you stop pushing? <clears throat> Little John. Uh, hello. Nice day. Uh, hey, Chief, cut the frills. Get to the point. Just shut up. What is it, Little John? Uh, well, it's uh, nothing, really. You helped a young man. Oh, you mean Duncan. Right. Well, what if he's a spy? What if he's working alongside Baron Arwen? No, he was being chased by bounty hunters. Uh, hmm. Well, that sounds okay. So he must be a thief or a killer. <laughs> What did you do that for? You dare say one more word against Duncan and I will never speak to you again! I don't like to interfere, but the Chief is saying this for your own good! Well, you can tell your Chief he needn't worry! So why are those men chasing him? He must have done something illegal. You don't even know where he's from! He used to work for a circus! So why'd he come all the way to Sherwood Forest? He's right! You can't believe all his stories! You're right! What can I do? How can I prove I am who I say I am? Huh? Maybe this will help. Huh? Ha! Yep. Hmm. Huh. Hey! Ha! There. Hooray! Ah, thank you. Yay! Thank you so much. Yay! I. Oh. Uh, it's. It's nothing. Don't worry. Yeah. Little John, please go away. You're no longer welcome here. Huh? B B Winifred! What about me? But... I, uh... Hey, Chief! Huh? Oh. Chief! Oh. I'm sorry, uh. your wound must hurt! Uh. <laughs> you mustn't be upset. I'm okay! <laughs> You're very kind, uh. Winifred. Uh. Please. Don't cry. Duncan? <laughs> well, you too. You don't look very happy. Huh. You're just a friar. 
You don't understand about love. Right. The chief's heart is broken and no one can do a thing about it. Right. So Winifred gave you the cold shoulder? Huh? How do you know? I can tell by his face. Never mind the smart remarks. Just tell me how I'm going to get her back. What do I do? Wait. Time will heal all wounds. Well, it might. <laughs> Horses! Let's hide! Huh? I don't believe you gentlemen are parishioners of mine. Listen, have you ever seen this man? Mm, a handsome young fella. He doesn't look like a thief to me. Well, he is. He steals only from rich people. I see. He takes money from those that have too much of it. What? Quiet. Some people think that this man is a hero, but he isn't. He's a crook. Yes, of course. If you see or hear anything, we're camped over there by the hill. Right. I'll try to remember. Ah! Those guys are new around here. From their manner, I see they were bounty hunters after one of their victims. Huh? Hmm, that face is kind of familiar. Well, come on, Much. Do you know him or not? We're waiting, Much. Aha! Shouldn't we stop now? Don't you think we have enough? Well, yes, but as we have a special guest, I'd like to pick some more. Duncan needs to build up his strength. But Winifred, even if he wanted to, Duncan could never eat them all. Don't forget Robin and Will. Those two are always eating loads of fruit, you know, Marion. And also, I want to pick some more for Friar Tuck. Hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> This card represents love. It could mean there's romance in store for you. What's that card you have? Oh, it's the card of love. <laughs> you know these cards? Yes, I used to watch the maids in my castle when they read the cards. Oh, Marion, do you believe in them? It's Duncan, isn't it? I met him right after Tuck had read my cards, so I thought that he... I see. I was scared when we first met, but he reassured me. <laughs> yeah. Huh? What do you want? Do you live around here? What's it got to do with you? Have either of you seen this young man? What's he accused of? He's a crook, a dirty, low-down thief. No! It's not true! It can't be! Hmm... I see. I don't know him. I haven't seen him. No! Nor do I! I don't know him! Hmm... Hmm... Wow! Hey, can you read these cards? As a matter of fact, I can. I'm an expert, Jenny. Oh, you're kidding! I used to read them as part of my circus act. Well, then! What do these cards have to say? Well, let's see. Huh? Uh-oh. What is it? Is it bad news? Hmm. I hope not. Well, what do you have to say about this? Little John, what is it? What's got into you? It's our friend here. It can't be. Apparently, he's a very skilled thief who steals from rich and noble families. He's a wanted man. It's absolutely true. He only steals from the rich. He steals from the rich? So the poor must think he's a hero. Hmm? Huh? Why would that make him a hero? Well, if he only robs from the rich, the wealthy, the big fat landowners, that means that he won't attack the poor people, doesn't it, Chief? So he's a hero. <clears throat> you numbhead! That means he's not a dangerous thief. But he is. He's still a thief. Hmm? Huh? Yeah. You're right. Will, how can you let your sister hang around with a dangerous crook like that? Well, I... Uh... Come on, speak up, man! Are you Winifred's brother or ain't ya? What about you? You're the biggest crook I know. Huh? I think I should explain. What happened to me happened to a lot of people where I come from. It's quite a few miles north of here, and it all happened when I was little more than a child. 
The soil was very poor in that area. Crops were thin and sometimes even failed completely. The people went hungry. What little we did manage to grow was taken by the rich landowners together with rents that we couldn't pay. People were either thrown into prison or died of starvation. There were more orphans there than there were famines. You either gave in or fought back. The only way to do that was to take back what the rich had stolen from us in the first place. It was during one of the raids on a rich landowner's house that my luck finally ran out. The soldiers caught up with me, and I was wounded. I fled south to Sherwood Forest, and that's where Winifred found me. So you see, I only stole what was mine. I had no choice. Wouldn't you have done the same? <sighs> Quickly! They've kidnapped Winifred! <laughs> Winifred! The cards were right. Think he'll come? Of course he will. He's bound to. The crook wants to save his girl. <laughs> He's no crook! Sure he is. One of the worst. <laughs> oh, Duncan! When he comes to rescue you, we'll have him. <laughs> Winifred! Little John! Take it easy. It's your fault she got into this mess, big shot! What do you care? Those guys are only after me. Just let me go in alone. But Duncan... I'll make sure they let Winifred go, Robin. Oh, sure you will. Look! Hmm. I know them. I know how they operate. I'm sure I can get Winifred out. Just trust me. What? Hmm? Are you looking for me? Ah. Then come and get me. Hmm. Very brave, my friend, and very, very stupid. I can assure you, you won't get out of here alive. No, Duncan, look out! No! Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. Huzzah! Ah, after him! Bullseye! Missed him. How did he do that? So long, suckers! Huh? Get over there! Uh. Ooh. Ah, just dropping in! Uh. Uh. Hey! It's Robin! And little John! Well, don't just stand there! Run for it while we take care of these uh. guys! Gotcha! Oh. You shouldn't mess with us! Your friends are pretty good. something to tell you. Huh? I know what you're gonna say. Hmm. Winifred, you're my friend, right? Uh-huh. I'm gonna show you something. Uh-huh. Here. This card tells me that my quest is not over. Do you understand that? Of course. One day we'll meet again. I'm glad fate brought us together. Hmm. Goodbye, sweet Winifred. Oh, Duncan. Thanks, Robin. You can let them go now. They won't catch me. Ha! Goodbye, Winifred. I'll never forget you. Thanks again for saving my life. I'll never forget that. Goodbye, Winifred. You're breaking my leg. Let's go! Ah. Yeah. Let's get after him! Come on! One day we'll meet again. Winifred! Winifred! Hey! You okay, Winifred? Duncan! Winifred! You do trust me, don't you, Winifred? Oh, Duncan, of course.
course I trust you. Goodbye, sweet Winifred. Hey, Winifred. You okay? Hmm? Goodbye, Duncan. And take care. Goodbye, Winifred. One day we'll meet again. We'll meet again. The forest hide away. The outlaws have made their get away. From the sheriff and his men. Their philosophy on life is to live and rob again. Has little John become a rich man? And why is Baron Alwyn letting a coach full of money be driven by Cleo? Our friends are surely planning to take Alwyn's money. And he is just as surely planning something nasty for them. Will it be riches or danger? Don't miss the next exciting episode of Robin Hood.